My love, beautiful souls, it's Mr. Close. I love, 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 back of two dark and light. This channel message. Okay, guys, so, um, so, what's happening over in the Middle East, you know what I mean, with everything with Israel and Ukraine and all that stuff, you know, yes, it's really happening, guys. Yes, this stuff is really, really happening. And it's not going to get much, it's not going to get better until it gets worse. And I've been wanting to talk about this for a while, but I didn't know if I could or whatnot and stuff. So we're going to see. I'm going to talk a little bit about it. But you guys, it, it is a distraction still, okay? You guys, it's a big ass distraction, okay? From the cabal, from like powerful elite people, okay? From big politician politics and stuff like that. This is a big, big distraction. And what the distraction is, is caused fear, okay? It caused fear in people's lives. So people are scared. People are scared to live their life. People are scared to, you know, enjoy life. And they want us to live in fear. The dark forces, the dark forces, okay? The reptilians, the gray, some of the tall grays, the draconians, some of the dark anakis, the archons. They want humanity to be distracted and live in fear so they cannot heal, they cannot grow, they cannot ascend. Because they do not want us to be higher consciousness beings, okay? They don't want us to have a higher conscious, okay? They want to keep us lower than them. They want to keep us stuck. They want to keep us enslaved. They want to keep us in fear-based, keep us scared, worried, stressed. So, yes, it's really happening. This stuff is really happening, okay? It's, it's not fake. It's not conspiracy. This stuff is really, really happening. People are really, really being affected by this stuff. Okay, with everything that's happening in this world, okay? With, you know, so why the Canada, with everything that's happening, the fires, the war, the fights, okay? Because they want to uh, separate us as well, okay? They want to separate us. They don't want us to come in union because by this, by all this distraction, by all this stuff that they're causing, this chaos, this destruction, this war, what's happening is it's causing a separation with humanity. It's causing a separation with each country. It's causing separation with each people, Okay? When we should be coming together. They don't want us to come together. They're, they're wanting us to literally separate. Okay? Wanting us to be against one another. Wanting us to fight. Wanting us to not work together. Come together. Love one another. Love our neighbors. Neighbors doesn't just mean your next door neighbor. Neighbors means your next... Your, your Neighbors means your state. Your next city. The country. The people on the other side of the world. It's everybody and anybody coming together, uniting together, loving one another. But by them doing this, it's distracting us, making us live in fear, making us hate one another, making us mad at each government. When we should not be doing that, we should be coming together. We should be praying, mass prayer, collective prayer, praying for the people that are being affected by this, that people have lost their lives. But when... It's all over media, social media. It, it, it's scaring people. It's, it's literally scaring people. Is it going to be over right now? No. No. To be honest, I feel like what I feel and what I'm hearing right now from spirit is the, it's the beginning. It's the beginning. It, it, it's also the beginning of to see who's on God's side and who's not on God's side. You know, when we're fighting against one another and we're using our material power the material power that is demonic that is the devil instead of coming together talking about this loving one another praying for one another all other things is everything's happening governments coming against governments politicians coming against politicians then keeping a lot of it from the media or I mean media keeping it a lot from the people so people don't know the truth. It's 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 just be it's just begun, and it, sometimes it has to get worse before it gets better. I have not read the full Bible, you guys. I've not read the whole Bible, but I've read bits and pieces. And one thing, and I've read is there's always destruction before something great's gonna happen. Okay, just like Kali, the goddess Kali destruction and then rebirth but 
it's what we do with it, how we react with one another. Are we coming together, helping one another, loving one another, praying for one another? Or are we fighting with one another, hating on one another, living in fear, anxiety, stress? Is it going to happen to us? When's it going to happen to us? Don't think like that. That's what they want. They want you to think like that. They want you to think, oh, it's, it's, it, it can happen any moment. It's going to happen here. It's going to happen there. Like, that's what they want. They're trying to distract you from your growth. They're trying to distract you from ascending. They're trying to distract you from raising your vibration and your consciousness. Because they don't want you to. Because once you raise your vibration and your frequency and step back into your higher self with source, creator, or God, you're going to be unstoppable. We're going to be unstoppable. As a collective, as humanity, as a human population. But all this stuff, if you read about it, all this, this fights, this military stuff that's happening, those are the Draconians, those are the Archons, those are the reptilians that want control, the cabal, people with power and greed, and they want to keep you from finding yourself, loving yourself. They want us against each other, separated, segregated. Because if we are like that, then we're not going to be able to evolve as a human race. We won't be able to evolve as a human race if we do not come together, if we do not unite. Trust one another, love one another. And we, we have to stop living in fear. It's there. It, it's happening. But demons and the dark forces, you guys, demons and dark forces feed off fear. So the more humans fe have fear, the more they're able to feed. The more they're able to do more destruction. The more they're able to um, ruin this planet. Cause chaos on this planet cause destruction on this planet and if you are have ascended 5d and have woken up you do understand what i'm saying by that by praying for one another love one another connect to one another not live in fear could it happen at my place right now where i'm at in minnesota it sure can it sure can but am i gonna want to fear that every day no do I want to think about it? No. God doesn't want us to stop our lives. God wants us to come together and live our lives and help one another out. I usually don't talk about this kind of subjects and stuff because it, it gets me really, really upset and anger when every time the government or politics or whatever or not just here everywhere they want to go right to battle they want to go right to war they want to go right to let's get guns out and knives out and go take out people bomb things like that's what they want to go do these these draconian all the people that are involved in that that are doing this these they're draconians they're archons they're they're reptilians they're they're that's all that that's what they want they want to fight 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 Destruction, destruction, destruction. Bomb, bomb, bomb. They get off of it. That's how they're, that's how they're destroying. Everyone is so... Wow. Hold on. This car must run out. They didn't see me. Tell them I'm paying attention. I was almost hoping I was going to get hit by a car, you guys. But then I'm like, no. I'm just going to hit by a car. Probably because I'm speaking on this. See, I was protected. See, if you guys watched it, I almost got hit by a car. But guess what? I was protected because I wasn't fearing it. I didn't fear it. I just kept walking. That's the difference. I was not fearing I'm going to get hit by a car. I was already in an accident, you guys. That's the thing is I know this is my vessel, my avatar right now. And once I something happens to me, I no longer going to be here. This vessel, this avatar will not be here, but my soul will go on. And I'll be reincarnated if I want to be reincarnated. It's up to me once I leave. If I sign a contract to be reincarnated... I don't think I will. 
I don't think I want to come back to Planet Earth. Maybe I will. I don't know. Um, gosh, I'm just going to talk, talk about that. Oh, I, I don't like talking about a lot of it because the fact that is, it does bother me. It hurts me that so many people's lives are being taken and so many lives are affected by this and stuff. But I do know that once they, they, they sign their contract, once they leave, they're going to be reincarnated again if they choose. Um, and they're going back home to Source Creator. But it, it just angers me because people think if they don't get their way, if they don't get their oil or they don't get their money or what they need, they need to get guns out or they need to start shooting people and they need to start freaking bombing things. Like, what are we going to get out of this, you guys? What are we going to get out of it? Tell me. Literally, tell me. What does people get out of this? Nothing. Nothing. But pure pain. And devastation. And hurt. Just by doing that. What do they get out of it? Nothing. Nothing at all. So are people's lives being taken. And having to start over. But those people, a lot of people aren't even affected. But like, they, they, they weren't involved in it. They were living their lives. They didn't, they, they didn't know half the things were happening. And then they just get something happening to them. You know, so that's why I don't talk a, little, a lot about this. Is because it does bother me. It hurts me. Makes me sadden. But then I, spirit tells me just breathe. Because they signed a contract. And when they when we die we like uh, we sign a contract you guys and that's what's for telling me we sign a contract and those people may not know it when they pass away but they send the contract to leave at that moment in time and that they will be reincarnated if they choose to be reincarnated okay but again big thing is and i know a lot of people are gonna be on here like it's not a distraction it is a distraction you guys it is a distraction to keep us separated to keep us in fear Yes, it's happening, but they're distracting us from what other things are supposed to be happening. Like, real things are happening. They're trying to distract you from your growth, from your evolution, from you ascending. Because you cannot ascend if you live in fear. You cannot ascend if you have not opened your chakras. You are unable to ascend if you are living in lower vibra vibration and frequency. Okay? You are able to ascend and raise your vibration and frequency and higher conscious if you are living in fear. And, um worry and stress and anxiety and addictions and in the program and in the, in the matrix they don't want you to wake up and that's what the when i say distraction they're trying to distract you from waking up but what they're doing what they don't realize they're doing is a lot more people are waking up because of it more and more people are waking up daily So, just remember things, you guys. Things are going to get worse before they get better. But what we need to do is we need to come together and start praying for every single human being on this planet. Praying for every single human being on this planet to find their way to God, to heal, to grow, to wake up, and come together as one unity, one consciousness. Okay. Unity and um, oneness is different. Oneness is when you're, you know, you're one with all. Unity is when we come together. Okay, when we actually come together, we work together. But oneness is when you know your oneness with all, with the trees, with the life and animals, and we have all purpose together. Oneness. Unity is when we come together, working together, our conscious working together. Unity consciousness. So. I hope that helps somebody. I really do. I love you guys. Love, peace, light, healing. Namaste.